it's cold out. Like, it's really cold out. Um, it's Saturday, January 1st. Happy New Year's. And uh, I'm running some errands right now, and then we're going to some hockey. I hope everyone had a wonderful Christmas and uh, a good New Year's, and I hope you're staying warm because um, it's cold. So this video is really about neighbors and being a good neighbor. I'm fortunate to live in a really nice neighborhood with some great people. And having neighbors uh, to count on is really a wonderful thing. And the same thing has happened with the city of North Branch. If you're not familiar, the city of North Branch has uh, a utility called North Branch Water and Light. And North Branch Water and Light provides electricity and water services to the city of North Branch. And they've been doing that for quite some time and done a very good job of it. Recently, they've had some issues with staffing and getting people. Um, as a utility that serves only about 2,000 services electric, um, it can be tough to maintain the staffing that you need to do that because it's a really small group and you know the guys, especially the linemen, have been really tasked with a difficult situation in terms of being always available to respond to outages and being able to um, help out when things are going on. When there's only two of you, it gets to be a lot. And so recently the city of North Branch contacted East Central Energy and said, hey, you know, would you be willing to help us out in any way? Is there something that we could do to um, alleviate some of our problems? And so uh, we've done that. We started working with them on some things and um, so far, so good. reality is for a utility like North Branch, um, there's a critical mass and critical mass is kind of this idea that getting done what needs to get done, it takes a lot of resources. Um, and the city of North Branch has come to the conclusion that, you know, effectively they're not going to be able to manage the utility in the way that they used to. And so they're making what I think is a very responsible decision to wind down the electric utility. The city is going to take over the water portion of the utility and East Central Energy is potentially going to be providing the electric service to the people who are currently served by the North Branch Water and Light Commission. It's a big change and it's a big transfer but the impact to the end users should be pretty minimal. Um, we're going through quite a few processes right now to determine the value of the asset um, and make a determination of what, what that's worth and so that we can come to a purchase price for the poles and wires and transformers and all of the equipment associated with the utility. And then we're also working on establishing a new power supply contract um, with the provider that currently serves the city of North Branch uh, from a generation and transmission perspective. So there's a lot of work going on behind the scenes. The end result for the, for the customers of North Branch Water and Light should be positive and a good thing and the overall result for the members of East Central Energy is also a good thing because we're not going to um, have a lot of cost associated with acquiring the service territory other than the value of the asset and so it's a good thing uh, for us as as a cooperative and a great opportunity to be that good neighbor that I talked about. good neighbor in your community is something that's really important to me. I think um, taking care of one another is something that it's not that hard to do and it's something that we can really make a difference in people's lives and I think as we as we go through this process with North Branch and we consider what East Central Energy is capable of doing I think we're gonna provide sustainability for the city of North Branch. We're gonna provide consistent and good rates for the citizens of North Branch who are currently served by North Branch Water and Light. And we're gonna kind of simplify the whole process that goes on um, with the residents. So overall, a very positive situation. The city of North Branch, their staff has been great to work with. I'm really excited about the potential of this project and what it can mean for, for everyone involved. And um, it's just an example of cooperatives really seeking to serve their communities and work in a way that benefits 
uh, everyone involved. And so I'd urge you, as you go forward into the new year, to think about how you can be a good neighbor to your friends, family, and your neighbors. Um, and once again, I just want to thank you for the opportunity to serve you. Uh, it is truly a blessing to be part of a community that cares for one another and to be a part of the success of your electric cooperative. Take care.